Uh, we've just been told that there, are, there isn't going to be any school here tomorrow at Timberview High School, which stands to reason uh, again after everything uh, that they've been through here today. I want to get now to our Malini Basu, who's been looking uh, a lot more into the suspect to give us more information about the man at the center of all this. Yeah, Chris, I am standing just about 10 minutes down the road from you. Uh, we're here at our apartment complex in Grand Prairie. And just moments ago, we saw officers take out bags of evidence. I tried to ask them what is inside and they couldn't answer. But they can look at the live look at the scene right now. This right here is the Dodge Charger in question. Officers just minutes ago, uh, actually, there is an officer on the other side right now taking pictures inside of the car. This is a live look at the scene. But I do want to take you back to just about an hour ago, members of the SWAT team here just searched a first floor apartment. We are here at an apartment complex off of 360 Frontage Road and La Valsa Street in Grand Prairie. Police searched that apartment. This is where they tell us the 18 year old Timothy George Simpkins drove to moments after the shooting. A source tells me the Dodge Charger he was driving is registered to his mother at another Arlington apartment complex. Now, people living here tell me that they haven't seen the suspect much around here. Then all of a sudden this morning, a witness says that he was getting ready to leave the house when he saw Simpkins driving the gray Dodge Charger. He backed into this spot where we are standing and then Simpkins ran into a first floor apartment. Now, throughout the afternoon, we saw police talking to some folks here and they searched another car. One woman says she was getting home from dropping her child off to school when she saw dozens of police officers. I just saw the police come like in full force around the corner at like 10 something this morning. Describe it to me. It was scary. I was like, what's going on? Because I saw the situation with the shooting at the school at Timberview um, this morning. All right, so again, right now, this is a live look at the scene. This is the car in question here. Police tell us Simpkins is charged with three counts of aggravated assault. And also, police officers found a 45 caliber handgun near the school, but it's unclear if that was the weapon that was used in the shooting. For now, we are live in Grand Prairie. I'm Malini Basu.